just felt comfortable with it. Uh, so, you know, those are the kind of type, the, the everyday life issues. How far is it to get to class? You know, in the Northwest, we've got a little more urban feel. Um, so, you know, is it walking? Is there green space? Those are the, those are the creature comforts that I think now seeing it with my daughter there, I wasn't in tune with it when I sat in your position. Yeah. You know, it's, you know, are there going to be enough kids like her where she feels comfortable so she can thrive? Or is she going to be odd man out? Odd man out's tough. Yeah. But, uh, I don't know what she sees in the, in the, even like you see them like, they're beautiful, but, I don't know, she looks at it through different eyes. Here, you can't Maybe I'm retrospective. What I, what I told Gianna was, don't look at the school as 18-year-old Gianna. Look at the school of 20-year-old Gianna. Because when you're 20, you're going to be tired of certain social scenes. You're going to be tired of doing certain things, and you're going you're gonna to evolve. And you're going to be much more mature. And what's important to you now is not important to you then. Comfort.
No, it's from Laguna Beach. It's the worst. Yeah, it's, uh, she's from Laguna Beach. And oh my god, the fucking shit that they do. Oh, just the pictures. I can't even look at her. So fucking. So then she gets an alpha feed, which is a big story. <laughs> he was, yeah, he's like, you know, when I uh, go up there, I think I'm gonna hang out with you. Yeah, I'm gonna hang out. And I said, you motherfucker, you haven't sniffed pussy in high school, and you're gonna go up to the major leagues. He's like, Dad, it's like a smoke show there. <laughs> nothing but dimes. This is direct quote. There's nothing but dimes. Look at these girls. I said, well, you can download all those in your spank bag. <laughs> And you're staying at the hotel with me in your mind. That's hilarious. That's so funny. Yeah. You're going to be right there. I'm so fucking tired. Let me see. Credit card or health insurance. Yeah. Hello? Hello?
Who's going to be Friday? Because you're going to bring, I'm 
just, this is almost exactly what I'm talking about. I love it. I said, you're not bringing him to school. He needs to go have a healthy experience because you're going to meet from kids from all around the world and they're going to be great. They're going to be smart. They're going to be like you. And you need to transition from a high school relationship into a college relationship with a boy that you eventually meet. And you have your boyfriend 3,000 miles away who's going to try to control you going out. You having to explain yourself. You not having the freedom to meet or interact or flirt yeah. with different guys. Yeah. That's not happening. I'm not spending $70,000 for you to have a long distance relationship and that he thinks he's going to come and visit and you're going to have a couple weekends. That's fucking not going to happen. Not going to fucking happen. So I got the boyfriend and I said, listen, I don't like you. I really never liked you. I love it. I want to be fucking clear, crystal clear on this. All right? I and my wife are actively telling her to date people now. And this was in April. Date people now. I'm going to encourage her to go out on dates. You're not going to say shit about it if she does. And if I have to block you on the phone, I have no problem doing it. So you need to get in your head that you need to go chase some other girls. You need to go into college, eyes open, and have a great college experience. But right now, I really don't fucking care for you. Is that true? Or is at that moment decided really? the really? time to turn. Hmm. Well, let me see. He, in the middle of the summer, texted me to go fuck myself. Oh. Huh. Right. Go fuck myself. So I had some interactions with his parents. And I said, listen, your 18 year old son is dating my 17 year old daughter. He sits out in front of my driveway and he cries at night. And I'm trying to get back with him. It's over. So, unless he wants to have a meeting with local law enforcement, and I live in a village where there's only 14 cops for 300 residents, and I think they're going to protect their resident. Sure. Now, he's creepy. What he's doing is wrong, and I'm going to elevate it to the next level. You can ask him. I am not a particularly nice person. Don't take it the wrong way. And there was another incident following that. And I called his parents at 6.30 in the morning on a Sunday. And I said, get your kid out in front of my house where he's getting arrested right now. And that was the last time. What did you ask her? She, she talked to you about it. But, like, two weeks ago, she called and she goes, you know what? Best thing you ever did for me, Dad. The best thing you ever did for me was allow me to come to college just for myself. Yeah. Touch. Yeah. Just come to college and think solely of myself. Yeah. I, I think it's great. It's got to yeah. happen because I told her this. I said, guess what? I said, I don't care what I, I, I assume you're a teenager. I hope you have respect for yourself and your body. He only wants one thing. He wants to you to touch his dick. He wants you to suck his dick. And he wants to put his dick inside you. And if you're doing that, I hope you're not doing it. Because I don't think you're emotionally ready for that. I think that changes everything. I don't I think you're just learning about this. But understand that that's all he wants from you. And as soon as he fucking does it to you, he's telling all of his friends. So if you want to respect yourself. You know, was that an April you told her? Uh huh. Was that an April you told her? You know, I started oh, talking to her. I said, I understand the longer this, this relationship goes, it's not beneficial to you. But he's just going to pressure you more and more. For more and more. He wants you to do more and more. That's all guys are. That's all guys want is pussy. If you think that he is in love with you, he ain't fucking in love with you. He's taking you out to eat. He's taking you to eat because he wants to fucking either put his fingers in you, put his dick inside you. That's it. That's it. I said, and if you're stupid enough to think that he loves you, you're as dumb as a doorknob. I said, I was a boy. That's all I wanted to do. I was growing. I said, I'm a 
grown man, and that's all I really want to do. I said, look, I, I carry your lunch break for certain things. <laughs>
visiting church all over. But who's the wacky one with the hypnotism? Paul Swensky. Yeah. Reagan, her name was Reagan something. Oh. It was an unusual first name. It started with an R. 
It's like a so, it's so Renee. 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 Yeah, and they all use it in their yearbook. Yeah. Renee Palomba. Renee There were 49 references. Oh, I got your class members. I fucking know it. No doubt. Ah, no doubt. Without question. Without question. Yeah. How did she not know that was published? Because it was in a yearbook. I know, but she denied it. She denied it. She denied it. She never kissed her. Yeah. She never even kissed her. Okay, but you know also. <laughs> there was no kissing. Well, there's not kissing going on there. There was no kissing allowed. Poor woman. All right, I don't care what you do, just don't kiss me on the mouth. I don't kiss her. No. I did not have sex with that woman.
you have told me? I come to God's own secrets. How crazy. Would you have told me, wow, that's really a stretch. <laughs> really a stretch. I know your capabilities. So I said, for you, that's really a stretch. I'd expect nothing less. Here, perfect. Don't, don't apply Surgical. my surgical things. Don't apply my skill sets. I need to be a, I need to be evaluated on the norm. The norm. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to be in the Hey listen, I respect you. you. Appreciate you would have told me that I was crazy. Yeah, I would probably say you were I'm gonna go that dude. I'm gonna go by. I'm gonna live in this apartment. I'm gonna do that. I just wanna be a weekend dad. Bye.
for about 6.30 and figure out where we're going to go to eat. That's my bag. It's a perfect bag. Who would argue about that? Fifteen rooms today. It's pretty. Oh, super nice, man. I mean, it was like six hundred bucks a night for the cottage. It's pretty. It's really super nice. If you're ever up there, you should look into it. But uh, I know. Yeah. I mean, you got family up there. I know. Yeah. That was the first time I've ever been up there. Yeah, there's a bunch of. I love the hours on that way. They're just quaint. It's the middle block. block. Yeah, there's a Salisbury is across. Salisbury is like five miles. School? No, no, the city, the port. Salisbury, the town. Yeah. What schools did we see there? It's uh, Andrews, Andrews Lowell, Andrews. You know, there's a lot of prep schools there. There's a prep school for. Uh, Let's see where you get in. You know, we'll go visit. Yeah, so I know that's coming up. Probably round two. January, February. Round two. Yeah. I'm just hoping she gets into USC when her piece of hands done. I think that's cheap, good boy. No, she, USC is one. And her piece of hands too. Oh. Oh. But she's going to find her reaction with her piece The Trojans. One of the actions where it's non binding, right? Yeah. Does SC do early action? No, they don't say anything. They defer. Karen first. Everyone defers. Okay, we will. That's what let's do. But there's uh, several ones that do date if you want to be concerned for any kind of scholarship money. You need or non need base. You're not getting any money. Just say. Oh, I know. I know. I have absolutely zero fantasies about that. Gianna came in, she goes, oh my god. Yeah, like I, no, I understand. The tuition bills and the grades, they all go to the kids. They, they're not permitted to send them to the parents. Yeah. Unless the kids sign a privacy release for each particular thing. Because they're a team? Of course. So, tuition release, easy. Grade release, easy. Can't get health information under any circumstances. They cannot do this. So she comes in, she's like, Dad, Dad, did you see the email about permission? I'm like, why? 
Doing those like uh, tax things, like have to pay part of your own account or whatever. Do you do like fat fucking guys that do that shit? Oh, yeah. What's it called? American Opportunity Tax Credit thing? No. If you find it, fucking send it to me because I've got a tax bill cut. I've got a tuition bill too coming on. Do you pay on your. Hey, Joe. Oh, what you doing? Joe yeah. just got back from Paris, everybody. I did. We're going to have a nice time. We're going to have a nice time. Of course. Gina, great. Right? We've never met before. I should do it. What looks great. We just left. Um, just like a year ago. Has it been a year? Yeah. It doesn't look bad. Yeah. Okay.
Um, I'll just leave that one there. Oh, we so we got the, the information that she was having an affair with the investigative officer of Orange PD that was coming out to the house to write up all the reports um, to set him up to get arrested, lose custody, adjudicate the girls as delinquent through a criminal complaint by the police. He held the police reports to see what he would say before, then he would give his statement to her so she could craft her response. And he was fucking her on duty. So, so today we are one. <laughs> Can't make your shit up. And that's the right time to live. How did you find that? She's had a new text message. She had, she did private detective on me. Followed me around Sugar and Falls taking pictures. Do you have any pictures? Yes. <laughs> of you? Yes. Of oh, Sean. Sure. Oh, <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> Some guy you did recently. I'm like, do they even fucking a goat? <laughs> so she also is an all privilege communication between she and English. She and August. So I have all their correspondence. I had to send those back. Um, she sent them to you right now. She had to produce all these documents. So she she gave a last name instead. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> it's the same. Uh, <laughs> it might be against you, but it's probably No, Shane, I'm not. Here's the one. It is on our system. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> 